But first, three people dead. So sad. I mean, just right here at Christmas. Family and friends say two of them were grandparents. Good evening, I'm Ann Allred. Mike has the night off. Multiple St. Louis families are grieving the loss of loved ones and searching for answers after a triple murder just before Christmas. It happened on Harney Avenue near Calvary Cemetery in North St. Louis. Our Casey Nolan joins live from police headquarters with reaction from those who knew the victims. Yeah, and it's a difficult night for a lot of people in this case. Family and friends tell me that two of these victims were grandparents found shot in an alley. Just really deep, deep sorrow, concern for the family. Around two in the afternoon, just two days before Christmas, police showed up to a shooting call on this block of Harney near Union in North St. Louis and found three people dead. One, they say, was inside a home, shot multiple times. The two other people were found outside in the alley. Neighbors and family members say they were both grandparents. A heart is heavy right now, and uh, for this to happen is it's just it's heartbreaking to the family. Bruce Mitchell says one of the victims was his 63-year-old nephew, who he says was the family comedian and a man they could count on. He took care of everybody. Now they will gather without him for Christmas. We go over my niece, you know, house, and we play dominoes, cars, and listen to music, and, you know, have a nice time. And, and it's going to be kind of hard because he ain't going to be there. So sad. I mean, just right here at Christmas and at any time, a loss of life. But the, I think about her grandchildren. They always remember that right before Christmas, my grandmother got killed. Mm. Irene Smith has lived nearby for nearly 40 years. People here say they don't know who could have done this, but Irene knows what she blames for shootings like this one. But there's such a prevalence of guns in our community. And as I said earlier, it's young kids around here. They can get a gun quicker than they can get to the store and get a candy bar. It's sad. I hope they find who did this. And give us some closure. That's all we want, a little closure. That's all I want them to find out who did this. Because yes. he doesn't bother nobody. No information from police on the person they say they found shot inside that home. Also, they have not officially identified the victim, so we aren't naming them either right now. And no info from police on any possible suspect. Live in St. Louis, Casey Nolan, Five on Your Side.